But the whole railing right here is literally like made out of rope. I have a real old bench right here. That's pretty cool. Also, not to mention, look at this wallpaper. How do you look at these windows? Like real slim. Whoa, what is this? What is going on everyone and welcome back to another video. Okay, so before this video even starts, 50% of the people who watch my videos aren't even subscribed. So go ahead and click the red subscribe button, it's free, and turn on that post notification bell by just ringing that bell and you'll be notified whenever I post a video. Also guys, on this channel now, I'm offering memberships. If you can see, it says join or you know become a member. And basically what you'll be is you'll be recognized in chat. I will make a personal thank you video. You get exclusive videos. You get videos I've never posted before, behind the scenes, uh, full explorers, crazy stories about explorers that I probably can't tell on YouTube and a ton more of exclusive content. And basically whatever you guys want me to post, I'll be FaceTiming you guys, call, uh, whatever. So let me know, give me some ideas but join the memberships on the channel and that is right here. So anyway guys, if you became a member, it would mean the world, but to not talk your ears off, this was an abandoned modern house. The backside is kind of burnt. We start off on the backside, kind of near the deck, and then we head around, kind of explore the burnt parts. And then in the middle towards the end is where we get into like the cool basement, all this cool stuff that's still left behind. But like I said, let's just go ahead and jump into the video. All right, everyone, so we're officially in here right now. I think I already said, but I'm with Carlos, so go check him out in the description below. Actually, I 100% did mention that. But anyway, we're in here. Behind me, there's just a little deck right here. And then this looks like it would have been a living room. But if you guys can't tell, this house was actually set on fire. So you can see the soot and the other black like remnants of what was here. Look at all this up on the roof. So you can see that this house was burned, but it's still here and it's still standing. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the whole railing right here is literally like made out of rope. Obviously it's just used as a design. All the way downstairs too it has it. That's actually pretty cool. It's back here. Now this is right behind the room Carlo's in filming right now. Look at this. The lights and stuff are just burned. Everything's black in here. But you can see, this is a nice big room back here. Look how it's burnt up on the door. So here's what's left of the kitchen right here. Looks like a fridge. So we do the test, so we see what's in there. Oh God. Ooh. Nothing. Whew. Try the freezer and uh, that would open real easy. Just an ice pack. Just got an ice pack in there. We have a washer and dryer, and then we have a stove. And then this looks like another way outside. You can see how badly burnt this place is. The door, now as you can see, this is just completely burnt and all torn out now. This would be actually kind of scary to explore at night because even though it's just burnt, it just looks much scarier once you're inside here. Here's an old bathroom. Oh my God, look how demolished this is. Look at this cream tub. I'm gonna put my shirt over my face. This is covered. This is covered in like soot and ash back here. What is back here? Oh, this is a big walk-in closet. This is a big walk-in closet. If you, hopefully you guys can hear me, you should be able to. Here's a little desk right here, a mirror. Man, this stuff is just covered in ash. Even has like a handicapped seat on it. Person who lived here must have been handicapped. Maybe, hopefully they got out of the fire, okay. But here's the old shower. Even has soap still hung up in there. Wow. All right, on this way. The staircase is awesome. Whoa, it's cold down here. Look at this old. It is, uh, they're all like that. So this is the basement right here. Definitely a TV or some type of like, uh, stereo would have been there. I have a real old bench right here. That's pretty cool. 
some more fire. Is that a fireplace? Yeah, that's another fireplace right there. And another fireplace. Oop. Check that out. Also, not to mention, look at this wallpaper. Kind of look at these windows, like real slim. It's kind of a really odd design, but it's kind of neat looking. What's on that? Also has a really bad smell. That's obviously because the house was on fire. Whoa, what is this? What do you think this room was? Like a kitchen or something of like some sort? Like a little bar area for the basement? Look at the door on it. Look how cool that is. That's really cool. I mean, it kind of defeats the purpose of a door because you can see right through it, but it has like a little tunnel, a little cave, and you end up in this room. And it's very cold in here, very cold. Look how cold it is, you can see my breath in here. Um, although this isn't the absolute biggest house, although it is a pretty, it's a decently sized house, it's really unique with the uh, kind of odd layout it has. But with the small unique rooms it has, it's been cool. Also, if you guys do know what this room was used for, whether it was just a, something as simple as a kitchen or like a wine cellar type thing, go ahead and drop a comment down below and let me know because I have no clue. Big backyard, full patio, huge wall over here. But let's go ahead and explore the rest of this basement. All right, so let's head over this way. See what else we can find. Whoa, look at this. This actually doesn't look half bad in here. Oh, this is a lot bigger than I thought over here. Here's a full little bathroom. The downstairs of this house, I guess, is technically the first floor because this house is built into a hill. Weird rooms, honestly. Look at the light switches on this place. Like a big button and then like a little switch. Just definitely more unique. A ton of mirrors in here. And look at this. You can just stab things into that. That's actually pretty cool. Just being in this place is weird. It just has a, like, the walls are teal with brick, wood flooring, like put mirrors all over. It's just a, kind of like an odd layout, but it's kind of cool. And it makes me just wonder because there was a handicap a toilet upstairs, who lived here and if they made it out. Hopefully they did. This house kind of creeps me out a little bit. Okay, so I didn't go over here yet. What is this? A f oh, this is a full kitchen down here. Check this out. Whoa. This is cool. This is like a little kitchen down here. Has a fridge, bunch of cabinets, like a little workspace. I can't put my finger on it. I can't tell like what some of these rooms are used for. Ooh, that smells really bad. Leave that shut. One of these uh, bottles of like chemicals, I don't know which one it is, maybe like that paint or something, but it has a really strong smell. Like to this day, oh my God, maybe it's this. I think I explored most of this side and I think it wraps back over towards Carlo. I think that was just Carlo. I think it was just Carlo talking. I think it's just Carlo talking. I thought I heard something. Wow, that bathroom is really outdated. A lot of this house is, but I like this big poster, uh, the big cork like wall over here. Yeah, and this true. one? Or yeah. <laughs> Look how gaudy this wallpaper is. Oh my god. This is just, I think this is the last room. Oh, look at this one, it has a dart in it. 
All right, everyone, I think that's going to wrap this video up. Like I mentioned in the beginning, as always, 50% of the people who watch my videos aren't even subscribed. So I'm missing, <laughs> there's so many people who watch and they don't even know they're not subscribed. It's free, click the button, it means the world. Like I said, I'm offering the memberships. So there's channel memberships now and all you have to do is go ahead and click this button and I will be doing FaceTime calls, exclusive videos, um, personally thanking you. You get special badges when you comment on my videos so people know who you are and a ton of more exclusive stuff. Maybe I'll give away merch and stuff like that. But anyway, guys, that's the channel memberships. And as always, follow all my social media link down below and I'll see you in the next video. Later.